name is Stacy, and I work at Community United Against Violence. Uh, Johanna and Fred are a couple of our members, and you'll be hearing from a couple of our other members tonight as well. So we've been around since 1979. We are the nation's oldest lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, and queer anti-violence organization. And the population that we work with are primarily low and low income LGBTQ people. Um, and we are here to express our concern at the use of considering tasers in responding to a mental health crisis. Uh, many of the people that we work with don't have access to um, health care, uh, mental health support, and are most likely the people that you will be uh, interacting with, with the tasers. Um, and so a lot of the people that we work with, they are also surviving many forms of violence. To put them through the additional trauma of experiencing being tased uh, sounds, as the first speaker mentioned, terrifying. Like, that is exactly our experience. We are happy that you are pursuing verbal de-escalation training, and we really just want to encourage you to really pursue that and really consider the non-violent uh, options at your disposal. That's great.